my friend Amy and I had been talking about storytelling forever. And we were, we're always people who are talking about this American Life, the Moth, or some new great story we heard. So along with Matt's friend Adam, we all met at Maharaja and decided, you know what, let's 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 have an event in six weeks. And next thing you know, we're at Art Bar having a bunch of storytellers come and share two personal stories about uh, we had a theme, and since it was the first event, our theme was beginnings. And ever since then, more and more people have shown up at events. Storytellers have flocked. We've had lots of volunteers throw other names in the hat. It's kind of amazing how it started out as a small idea and a couple of enthusiastic people. It's managed to grow into this gigantic thing where so many people get to come together and have this great sense of community and share stories. So. I had the opportunity to work on so many different projects, and I think that a lot of it, a lot of it was, you know, planning and organizing an event, uh, which I continue to do today, both with my sketch cabinet group, with X Fabula, and then even in different jobs I've had. Um, it's been really important to say for every event, if you plan it well on the front end and you make sure that the contract has everything you need, your event's much more likely to go smoother. One, one idea that I first got connected with from Public Allies was um, multiple intelligences. I remember there was a multiple intelligences training that was just kind of amazing to me. That training kind of broke it wide open for me. And ever since then, I've tried to be more innovative in my teaching. 